What's up guys, Tian here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the release of iOS 13 and iPadOS 13 Beta 5. We're going to be taking a look at what's new in the update and whether you should update or not. So with all that said, let's begin. All right, guys, I'm now on iOS 13 Beta 5. First thing we notice here is that the build number ends in the letter D instead of the letter F, like in Beta 4. This build number basically indicates that we're going to be seeing several other betas before iOS 13 is officially released in September. Let's get to those new changes. The first thing we notice in iOS 13 is that when adjusting the volume using the redesigned volume HUD, you now get aptic feedback. Very subtle, you barely even notice it. In the music application, if lyrics aren't available for a song, that button will be grayed out. Apps now show permissions for everything. You can now go into settings and disable permissions for a specific app. For example, you can disable microphone access, contacts, background app refresh, a specific app you have installed on your iOS or iPadOS device. And it works for every single app. In iPadOS 13 Beta 5, now have the option to choose between a 4x5 or 6x5 app icon layout for the home screen. Find this by going into display and brightness and scrolling down to the bottom. There are larger cellular icons in the status bar. In series shortcuts, the automation tab has been removed. The share sheet looks a lot more organized. What do you guys think? In the home app, we have some new wallpapers. These are just some of my personal favorites. There are a total of six new wallpapers in the home app. Okay guys, so those are all the features that I can find in iOS 13 and iPadOS 13 Beta 5. I'm sure there are a lot more features to discover. I'll make sure I update my community tab as well as my social medias as soon as I find more features and or changes. If you guys enjoyed today's video, let me know with a like or dislike. If you guys like the content that I post on this channel, be sure to subscribe, enable notifications for all things Apple, and I'll see you guys in my next video. I've been Tian Official. I'll see you guys next time.